Right now we're about a kilometer off the coast of Mayon Province in northern Vietnam. We're looking for uh, two missing naval aviators from the Vietnam conflict. Uh, we believe that they're located somewhere in, in, the, in the water adjacent to this barge right now. We, we brought the uh, mobile diving and salvage unit team with us and they're going to oversee the diving aspect of the mission. The method that we use for searching underwater, we set up an underwater grid and we dredge the mud looking for bones. We'll stake it down however Rich decides the grid, to do it. The grid is a box that we placed on the bottom around a possible hit that we had. Just gives us a bearing so that way in zero visibility we know where we're going to be sucking and how deep we're going to be sucking. There is a again. Grid and stake down. Understand grid stake down. Next is going to be the basket. That basket's going to be catching all the material that we're going to be dredging out of the grid. That basket's also going to be traveling that material up top side so we can sift through it to find what we're looking for. Hold that. Hold that. So we uh, got our first uh, two meter square excavation unit completed. We still have to screen the, the contents of the basket they filled up to verify that that is a clean unit. If we find diagnostic material, we'll go deeper and uh, we'll expand the unit. If we find no diagnostic material, then we'll move on to the next test unit. Getting to this point, it's a, it's a lot of hard work. But, I mean, the payoff's worth it. I speak for a lot of folks in our organization are combat veterans, you know, Afghanistan or Iraq. So, I mean, it was, this mission obviously holds a very special place for us. We would want something like this to happen if something were to happen to us, like what happened to these two aviators who we're looking for today. Well done, well done.